What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Umthar Game Channel. I am AJ Gels. Guys, I'm uh, about to start a new series. Uh, obviously, this is Gears of War Judgment. Uh, this is the prequel to the Gears of War franchise. Um, I, honestly, I don't know a whole hell of a lot about this one. I, I remember playing it uh, around the time it came out. And uh, I, I haven't played it probably since probably 2013, so it's been a couple years. Uh, all I do remember is that uh, this takes place at the end of the Pendulum Wars... Uh, beginning you know, E-Day, uh, you play as um, Baird, so, you know, and it's kind of his squad, it's kind of like, um, it's all kind of told through flashback, it's like he's going through a court-martial process, it's, it's an interesting uh, way of telling the story, it's got some good jokes, obviously, you know, we're playing as Baird, um, uh, I don't know, I'm, I'm kind of, I'm, I, I, I'm really interested to play this again, um, I don't know, you know, now that I'm, you know, doing this YouTube channel, um, now that I'm, I, I, I don't know, probably smarter than I was back when I started this, uh, when I first played this game. Yeah, basic explain the Yankees War Tiles, this will like blah, 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 okay. Yeah, I know the basics. Uh, that brightness is fine. Uh, let's see here. Let's go to the campaign. Huh, I might, uh, take a look at that. Interesting. Alright, let's start, uh, Judgment. Like the, uh, other Gears of War games I'll be playing on Normal. So guys, uh, sit back and enjoy. This is, uh, Gears of War Judgment. Make sure the bastard's dead. Go! Move, Lieutenant Baird. denied any right to an attorney and may not question the authority of this tribunal. So we can't ask why you're doing this now. At the conclusion of this tribunal, I will issue a fair and swift verdict. Right. Of course you will. Colonel, are we being charged with doing our job? The charges will be defined as I hear your testimony. Now, Lieutenant Baird, begin with the last time we saw each other. So they're being tried without an attorney for charges that are yet to be given. Alright, we're off to a great start. Our mission was to rendezvous with a supply convoy. But then, things started to go wrong. How exactly did things go wrong, Lieutenant? Gradually, sir. And then... Whatever it was, 
was, it looked like it was headed right for our combo. Only Paddock knew it. We've been saved. Not yet. Bay for a few days. We'd seen some action, but nothing like, um, you know. Nothing like what, Lieutenant? Nothing like Karn, sir. Man, that's a weird that Y switches your weapons instead of the buttons. Or instead of the uh, D-pad. That's a, that's a weird change. Oh yeah, you don't have a sidearm in this game, do you? Warm for me! the thing the uh, top left corner that's a uh, kind of like a running like you get scored for each chapter mission uh, I don't know whatever the hell you want to call it we went as fast as we could sir there was no saving that convoy I discovered the facts that were amended from the official record in declassified missions. Here you will take on additional challenges and earn stars faster. Use caution, your inability to fully declassify a mission will result in mission failure. Right. Kiva Squad claimed uh, to encounter unknown locust variants. Dark wretches replace normal wretches. Let's I heard go. Other units talk about the glowing wretches. But I thought that was just soldiers telling stories. Turns out it's not. Our old convoy had been wiped out in minutes. Never seen anything like it. I didn't know that women were in the cogs before three, because I thought they joined. Because I thought the women played were in a. I I, I know you you say whatever, but I thought in, in you know in the in the gears world, women were in the support role. That the cogs were all guys. Not I I, I want it clear and out front. That's not me saying that. That's what. I don't think I've actually shot and killed anything in this entire series so far. I think I've all I've done is chainsaw. Um, 
that's not me saying that women have to play the support role. That is just me saying I thought in the, uh, you know, world of years of war, I thought that was uh, what they did. I kind of like how they made quick throwing grenades a little easier. <laughs> I love planting grenades. Those wretches died. They exploded like they'd been drinking out of a fuel tank. I hoped we wouldn't be seeing them again anytime soon. Colonel Loomis, this is Lieutenant Baird. Big problem, sir. Our convoy just got destroyed. Then move on to the Museum of Military Glory. It's under attack. Sir, whatever destroyed our convoy is still out there. Noted, Lieutenant. Yes, sir. That's a sniper on, rifle around here. You heard the man. And you know what? It doesn't mean I like him. Uh, about what I said earlier, or you know, when I'm when I'm trying to make sure that I'm not misunderstood about being sexist or or about what I'm saying being, well, it, you know what? Screw that. I'm I'm I, I do that enough. I'm I'm fucking done with it. I'm just gonna I'm if if you take offense to some I'll just say this. If you take offense to something I say, please go into the comments and tell me and I will be more than happy to explain myself or explain the um thoughts behind that statement. It, it's just cuz it takes too much time to um you know, go through it. Uh, you know what I mean? It just, it, it's, I don't know. The museum was on the other side of the river, the side the cod no longer controlled. I thought maybe we could slip through unnoticed. Yeah, nice. Kind of reminds me of my old wine cellar. Wait a minute. You have a wine cellar? Hey, look. A man gotta spend his money on something. This is the UIR sniper rifle. This isn't a gun! It's a comrade. Uh, the UIR was the, um... Uh, the, uh, the not, not the cogs in the, um, Pendulum Wars. If you see, um... I'm trying to think what his name is. Oh, crap. Uh... Paddock. Jeez. Uh, he was a UIR soldier. I think they kind of made them Russian. A lieutenant claimed unauthorized Hammer of Dawn strikes took place in Old Town. Finished before Hammer of Dawn strikes and four minutes failure will result in death. Someone designated the Old Town a Hammer of Dawn free fire zone without telling any of us gears about it. And with our radios down, we had no way of letting control know we were there. We needed to hurry. You know, 
I think this is a... Uh, the way they did this game was really interesting. Um... Words are hard. The way they did this game uh, was extremely interesting. Seeing that they uh, kind of played with this whole it's being cold and you know it, it, it's, be, it's being cold from the uh, come on, like Baird's telling a story. You know, it, so it's we can have the fun of Dom narrating. We have the. You know, we have, I, I, I'll hopefully finish the statement. We have, uh, son of a bitch! We have the fun of Dom's narration. We have, uh... They brought out the heavy gear! Jeez, this, you know, like these declassified missions that are kind of like the unofficial story. I don't know, I mean, like, I think this game has a totally different kind of... I need pace and feel to the original. Uh, maybe not necessarily true. Maybe feel isn't the right word. It is. It has a totally different. Uh, it's a very different pace than the original. Uh, I kind of like how those ammo pickups are, uh... <laughs> those ammo pickups, like, you don't have to press X to get them, you just kind of bend down and grab them. The, the, this is something I'm not a huge fan of from this game, is this, um... It, 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 like, at the end of each chapter or episode or whatever, we go, in, we go into one of these, especially at the beginning when they're kind of short. Um, I don't know. It's, it's a little annoying. It was faster to go through the empty buildings than around them. They were all so abandoned. If no one here had been evac'd, where was everyone? I got on Cole before he got, like, really giant. class stuff. Oh, jeez. Kilo, Kilo Squad utilized a prohibited locust weapon and claimed it was effective. I know we're forbidden from using enemy weapons, Colonel, but to survive out there in the field, you have to know how to adapt, and I'm an adaptable man. Claimed 
it was affecting my ass. This gun sucks. You got a healing canvas! Hit it! Now I know why they needed reinforcements. Right, in this game they, they made the uh... They made the hammer burst uh... Semi-automatic. Back up. Say this the uh, um, <laughs> geez, the side off shotgun in this game is way better than it was in three. Get back in the game! this gun when they don't like explode into pieces they just kind of disintegrate Man. 
Man, I ain't never seen so many grubs in one place before. I know. Let's just get inside. Alright guys, uh, that's gonna be the end of this video. I hope you guys are enjoying these, uh, I don't know, this kind of new style of Gears of War. Um, I don't know, I, 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 I'm kind of lukewarm on it. I mean, I think it's a, it, it's a neat game, it, it's a neat way to do this game. Um, I, I don't know, I think it kind of loses some of the cinematicness. I'm gonna make that a word. Uh, that Gears of War 1 through 3 had. Uh, but it's still, I think it still has some merit. Um, but I, either way, I hope you're enjoying this. Uh, but you can find me on Facebook, Twitter, on my website, down in the description below. Like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed the video, you want to see more, all that stuff. Um, so, uh, guys, until next time, I'm AJ Gills. This is the Unthar Gaming Channel. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm out.